Hey guys, welcome to For Tutorials. Guys, today I create really cool band test animation in Cinema 4D. So firstly guys, I take cube and guys change cube size. X size I take 50 and Y I take 300 centimeter and lastly take 50. And now guys, I go to display, select God shading lines and I increase segments. Guys go on segments Y. I take 50 and now guys go on chord and increase this P axis increase like 100 actually I take 150 yeah right and now make editable this cube click here make editable and after that guys I take band tool this one so select this band and make child with cube guys select this cube and I go to object and fit to parent check. Yes. And this is my strength. Guys, see. This is my band text animation. Right. So now, guys, I increase frame like 160. 160 frames. And strength take 0 on 0 frame and strength check. Guys, I go to 30 frames. And strength I take 25 yes and press this strength animation key now guys I go to 60 frame and strength I take minus 30 and check and lastly guys I go to 90 frames and strength I take 0 and check right so go on back and play yes see guys this is my simple animation, right? Okay, now guys, I take cloner. So I go to more graph and use cloner. So guys, select this cube and make child with cloner. Guys, select cloner and object change mode. I take grid array. Yes, guys, mid count I take 1 and I increase this count. Actually, you can change mode firstly. This one I take this time per step. And guys, you can increase count. Count I take like 10. Yeah, 10 is better. And guys, same. This third count I take 10. Yeah. See, guys. Right? Okay, now go on back and play. Yeah, great. Right? Okay, guys, I apply some effectors. So select this cloner, more graph. And firstly, guys, I take step, this one. Yes, guys, I go to parameter. Scale size uncheck and only change this time offset. Guys, time offset like 50 frames. So go on back and play. Yes. See, guys, this now realistic waving animation. Right? So stop. And now, guys. I apply random effector so again say select cloner more graph effector and take random and position uncheck change only this time offset this time randomly guys like 15 again guys change I take like 10 10 frames Yeah, 10 is better, right? This is good for me. Okay, now stop. And guys, this time I apply delay for creating smoothness. Select and guys go on effect. Strength, I increase like 60, 60% 60 and mode, I take spring. Yeah, that's really cool. 
and lastly guys i apply shader so select this cloner more graph and apply shader guys go on parameter scale size uncheck only change this type offset and like randomly 15 yes see guys that's really cool right guys my animation is finished so now i apply light go on file and merge select c4d studio light and open guys go on front view panel select flow and background and down and over at softbox go on mid and up guys small softbox go on back guys camera view like this and i take camera and camera check guys select this camera and change focal length i take like 30 yes see guys this is my camera right guys lock this camera angle right click cinema 4d tag and use protection now this lock right and guys i apply materials so go on load materials select and open guys apply a random material like yellow yeah yellow is really good right okay now i go to on render setting output guys i take full hd frame this one and take all anti select only geometry guys mb occlusion maximum sam i take 1 to 8 accuracy 100 percent and take global illumination right and go to save guys format i take jpeg sequences and this is my save file path go on desktop you can create folder like renders rand and take any file name and save so close and render press ok right guys this is my renders guys i show you how to create jpeg sequences to movie so close render now guys i show you my renders see guys this is my jpeg sequences renders right this is my pink color and yellow right so guys i use this time premiere pro i open premiere pro yeah create new project and location you can take desktop and press ok that's it so now guys go on project this is my import media import so select this select only first one frame only select first frame and guys don't forget image sequence check and open right again import this time i take blue select first frame and image sequence check and open apply more this is my red and lastly guys i already create yellow and open right guys you can add your music this is my music and import right so guys select this red drag and drop in timeline right guys so select this red and guys create duplicate so holding control key drag and drop right see guys this is my simple animation play guys import music drag and drop
ಬಿಸಿಲೆ ಯಾ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಗೈಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಸೆಲೆಕ್ಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಬ್ಲೂ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅಪ್ಲಾಯ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಬಿಟ್ ಗೋ ಆನ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಯೆಸ್ ಸೊ ಗೈಸ್ ಸೆಲೆಕ್ಟ್ ಬ್ಲೂ ದಿಸ್ ಒನ್ ರೈಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಗೈಸ್ ಸೆಲೆಕ್ಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪಿಂಕ್ ಸೆಲೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆ್ಯಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಗೋ ಆನ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಯಾ right great and lastly guys yellow right guys see select drag and drop okay now guys i apply cross at so right click on here apply default transaction and also here and also here yes see guys this is my final animation right so guys cut here on last so delete you can delete extra music so right click on last part apply transaction right okay guys export this animation go on file export and export media and presets i use this one high quality 1080p and this my output name go on desktop take anything like intro intro and save and export that's it guys so guys this my final animation is finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you guys i show you my final output so after render i show you yeah render is finished go on desktop this my final output guys thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel thank you